How's it going guys? I'm your host Carbine Gaming. Welcome back to another Let's Play Dragon Table episode. So in the last episode we already finished off the energy orb. So today we are going to be starting on the fire orb. That's right guys, so we are more than halfway through the orb saga. Very very exciting. So we've done one, two, three, four, five, five of the orbs already. Technically four if you don't count the darkness orb as complete because I think you do need to finish out the Raven Lost saga or something, or at least part of it. In order to complete the darkness orb, which is kind of weird, but according to the timeline, the next part here should be the firewall, right? Okay, firewall, where is it? This one, right? Uh, a letter from Conan. Okay, how do I start this quest? Conan, apprentice to you, Garth Falcon Reacher's resident weaponsmith has received word that his hometown is under attack by a massive fire dragon. This sounds like a job for a certain dragon slayer, and you, the hero. Ooh, there is also the storm war here from uh, Nightdera. Okay, so this one, if you guys actually remember, we did it in our Dragon Fable uh, speed run contest. Unfortunately, I didn't win the contest, but it's fine. Okay, so maybe you'll go through that in a different time. There's also the Bacon Origin story from Valencia over here. Um, do you want to do the side quests now, or do you want to focus on the main quest? You know what, let's do the main quests first, alright? So let's do fire orb. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys want to see some uh, side quests and then maybe we'll do them next episode. So, so I believe it should be here. Yep. There we are, fire orb. Okay. Uh, have we done all of those yet? A plea for help. Kona has gotten a disturbing letter and would like to speak with you. I cannot remember if we have done those. Please, you have to help me. I've gotten a letter from my family. Our town is under attack from a giant fire dragon. A fire dragon? I'll do what I can, Conan. Wait, did we do this for the crafting one? I think we did this for the crafting one, right? I've been gone so long. If anything were to happen to them, I could never forgive myself. Please, you are a true hero. You saved Falcon Reach so many times. Please go and defeat this dragon and save my family. I'm glad you could come. We have a serious fight on our hands. Akulov has come and is laying waste to farmland here and we have to stop him. My blood brother Demento has come to help. Akrilov has always been one of the most powerful fire dragons on law. Do not underestimate him. As he is now in possession of the fire orb because of his deception of another adventurer, much like you. If he's so powerful, how are we going to stop him? I don't know, we have to try though. We are going to have to get close to Akrilov first, which means fire away through his fiery minions. Good luck, you are going to need it. Uh, yeah, okay, we've done this before, I recognize the monsters here. North. Kona has been at work at the forge since you returned. He refuses to speak with anyone. We must defeat Akrilov. Demento is planning on heading north. Would you like to speak with him? Akrilov must be stopped. I wish we see more of Demento. Apparently he is Galanov's blood brother, but yeah, we rarely see or hear of him. Even in Dragon Fable itself, we rarely see or hear of him. Like AQ, I definitely don't remember seeing this guy at all, so yeah. We'll go north and search the frozen wastes there. There is a clan of ice dragons as well as a rumor of something more ancient. Something that dwells in the glacial clay caves and collects the frozen remnants of battles long past. Will you go with me? Of course, the mental eye. Whatever I can do to help bring down that fire dragon. What or who are we searching for? Long ago, the elemental lords placed guardians on law to protect their realms. It is said one of the ice dragons... Ice Guardians became corrupted, greedy. Instead of protecting the area left to it, it incited battles. It stole treasures and weapons, including the Ice Scythe. Ice Scythe? The Ice Scythe was crafted from the coldest glacier ice, cut from the depths of a lost cavern and enchanted with a powerful special effect. I believe that if you hit Aquila with the Ice Scythe just once, it will drain its power and transfer some of its strength to you. It should make the fight fair, but first we need to find the corrupted Guardian's lair. Okay, let's go here. Uh, Frost Goblin. It should all be weak to fire, I think. Fire. Use our fire gem daggers here. 50% more damage. Let's do wild daggers. Oh, and just nice. I think I'm dragon fire, fire, right? Yep. Okay. So we'll try to skip through whatever we can skip through. Hope we don't have to fight all of them. Oh, nice. You can avoid them all as well. I did not know. That's certainly nice. Let's do stun. So back to fighting Kilgrins, it seems. Uh, can you run? Can you run in between them? Nope, you can't. So you gotta fight them. That's okay though. Maybe if I hug the top wall, you could 
escape. Or maybe I might have needed to fight the bear. So, yeah, I don't think you can hug the top. Okay, here, can we go through the middle? Yes, go up. Oh, nice. Okay, this should be a healing spot or something. Nope, okay. This is a chonky guy, so we'll do lash. But we won't be able to finish him off next turn. Even with the stun. <clears throat> yeah, more HP usually means lesser damage at uh the low at the early game. So the monsters either hit very hard with very low HP or they have very high HP but you know uh don't hit hard at all. Okay there we are. Oh shiny, okay the Shaktena. Uh huh, okay wait, I was wrong. That was not a checkpoint or anything. Wait a minute. Where are we? Oh okay, there's a path down here. Wait, where did this kill come from? No, why did I even not see it? Wait a minute. Am I not paying attention or what? How come I didn't even see it? Or maybe there was one here. Okay, never mind. Three of them, okay. I get this one crit. Oh nice, we got one crit, okay. Yay, okay, good. <coughs> nice. Uh let's see, let's go. Nope. Gotta fight again. So yeah, a lot of the older quests is not like the newer quests whereby you, if you're smart, oh my god, wow, that guy hit like a truck. But if you're smart with the running, you can actually avoid a lot of the enemies. Like now, these newer quests is like a straight path, and like there's there's nothing you can really do to try and avoid them. I wish they would make it uh more like the olden days. Where like if you're really good with a mouse, you can avoid some of the enemies whereby the hitboxes are that big. But I guess nowadays, since you can play the keyboard, I suppose that wouldn't be super fair. I don't really know. Let's see. Let's try with the keyboard. Nope. Okay, so yeah, the keyboard is nice to avoid it. Let's slash. Yep, this guy should hit pretty softly. Oh wait, he can stun us as well. Wow, okay. Is this it? Nice, okay. And let's see, what does he do? Here, look. Do you see them? See what? The caves, they, they're in the mountainside. We'll come tonight and explore the mountainside when we are rested. Demento. I thought all of Galanov's family had been killed by Akrilov. I'm not Galanov's brother by birth. Oh, Wait, I thought Galanov said they were blood brothers. So you mean more like swan brothers and not blood brothers? After Akrilov burned his family's farm to the ground, my family took him in. Oh, okay. Adopted brothers. Yeah. We became blood brothers shortly after that. Alright, I see. What happened to make you become blood brothers? Last. Gal was just 5 years old, but he was already fearless. I was 10 and apparently looked like good prey. I was out gathering wood for camp and a wyvern swooped down and grabs me in its claws. Wyverns will occasionally take smaller farm animals to feed their brood, but with our off rampaging, I was much easier prey. The wyvern swooped down to carry me off and gallon off ran. Hey, it seemed like he jumped 10 feet into the air and he grabbed hold of my legs and wouldn't let go. Our way together was too much for the wyvern and she dropped us back down. Gal saved me from becoming dragon food and I owe him my life. Anyways, it's time to get our energy. We have an ancient and corrupt guardian to face tomorrow. And we have to convince him to give us the only weapon strong enough to defeat Akrilov. Oh, I, I can't believe they're gone. My whole family wiped out. I've been gone so long. Seems like I spent years just standing around in Yuga's Forge when I should have been home. If, if I had been home, you would have been incinerated as well, my young friend. And this is sad. I understand your pain. I lost someone due to the carelessness of someone who I thought was a friend. Jenya. This PDF had to have tried it just. He's a hero. Yes, say Falcon Witch faced bandits and monsters. I've heard rumors that he even has a pet dragon. How could they lose so badly to this Akrilov? Ha, a hero? The hero and his pathetic bench should have saved your family. They only look out for themselves though. Gelanov only goes after the dragon. He could have saved your family. 
As PDF could have let them away, instead they were taken from you. My own love, my Gina, okay. Was Jania spelling that way in the past? Did they retcon it and change the spelling later on, or is this just a typo? Taken from me by the misfit mage, Wallet. Wallet, but, but he's good. That's why he wants you to think. But who's here now, offering to help you train you so you can get your revenge? Wallet and his little minion, they even attacked me. They stole my book of power, called me evil. But why? Jealousy Conan. Wallet caused the accident that took Jaina. Okay, second time they spelt it this way. I'm starting to think that they changed the name uh, afterwards. Yeah, and now he tries to steal my power so I can't get her back. They're only interested in their own power, not my ours. You have to give our magic to Kona. I can show you how to bend fire to your will, how to enchant with it, make it live and make it die. So it's going to turn him into a firebender. No mere fire dragon will be able to defeat you. And once Akrilov is gone, you can go after the ones that caused your family to die. The one that took my Jaina away from me. Get an off wallet of them. Ha 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 I wish they added a laughing effect here or a sound. They found a case, but what else within? Kinda want to hear what uh their, their impression of sense laughter is. I think that would be quite funny. I know Dove has voiced quite a few of the uh, vo vocal sounds before in game, but like it's it's not a common thing for them to voice it. But yeah. Oh, and this point of time, I don't know if Dove was already on the DF team yet or not because this is like very very early on in uh, Artix Entertainment. So probably Artix was still like the main developer here. Artix, maybe Alina, Geo Pedal, Rolif, you know, the OGs, the Guardian. You must defeat Akrilov. Bring back something from the frozen Northlands that can take Akrilov down. Okay, looks like we can't one-shot them. Let's see how hard they hit. Uh, that's alright, but I prefer not to take that damage since I don't know how long this quest is. So we'll just do stun here. Okay. <clears throat> hit here. I don't know what's the right way. So hopefully this is the right one. Can we avoid this guy? Nope. Right, health potion kept out. Oh, stun this guy. Otherwise he's gonna hit like a truck. Okay, wow. I'm going to guess it's probably up there, but we'll try down here first since it's nearer. Assuming You know, usually in games, the correct path is the path of most resistance. I don't know why, I guess they just want players to, you know, work Yeah. Usually the correct path is the path of most resistance. Oh god. What the heck? Man, the hitbox on this thing though. Oops, share stunned. Oh, okay, that wasn't too bad. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Okay, maybe this one doesn't do as much damage as the one just now. Okay. Yeah, I think because these guys have a bit more health than the ones we face right now too. I think that's right. Okay, makes sense. I guess not all monsters are created equal. Okay, we avoided the ice, that ice element, the snow elemental. Yeah, man, there's so many elementals inside the game. This is a snow elemental, right? The ice elemental one is the one that looks like a furry fire elemental, like a fire elemental with a. <laughs> there we are. 
I stole all of my treasures fair and square, you shall never take them from me. I am only here for the ice side, so that we can defeat the fire dragon Akriloth. Never, I do not care if the entire planet is destroyed, no one is ever going to take my treasures. I have spent my entire existence lying, cheating and stealing to get them. Innocent people are being hurt by Akriloth's rampage, you must give me the scythe so that I can defeat him. You mean this? Never, you have to pry from my icy cold talents, as far as I am concerned. You and the rest of the humans can all burn. Very well then, I challenge you to a duel for the ice scythe. Haha, <laughs> puny human like you, this should be good. Okay. Exhaust. Okay, yeah, this should be easy. Oh, weak to light as well, so do light. Oh my. A uh, little laggy. Not sure what the heck is going on. To wrap it. So yeah, this should be a piece of cake. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with the lag. Maybe it's cause I'm rendering a video right now. Yeah, maybe that's why. And then I have my AFK game running in the background as well. I'm currently rendering the, uh, what do you call it? The new duo challenge video. I just finished recording that and now I'm recording <laughs> the Let's Play the so yeah, the duo challenge took me quite a while to get done because yeah, it's a pretty tough fight and we haven't had a tough in challenge in quite a long time. So I guess it's a welcome change. But honestly, I hope we don't get too many tough fights all the time because it's very time consuming and <laughs> annoying for me as a content creator, you know, like I have to keep doing it and doing it and then like it's so, so freaking painful to just, you know, Keep trying to fight again and again to find the right thing to go and, you know, uh, beat the fight with. Especially if I'm trying to do it like weak call or like doing it with like, uh, you know, uh, non pay to win stuff. Yeah, that makes it a lot harder for me. Okay, uh, let's do blind here. Also, uh, I will be going through the new monthly items okay as well as the rewards from the in challenge in next uh next saturday's video next saturday's uh df release video so if you guys want to see me go through those items stay tuned for that i don't think i'll be go through it in the uh in this let's play df or on wednesday's video because i think more people watch my weekly release videos it's the same for aq as well so i think it's better if i cover it there if i cannot have the ice scythe then no one can, no one will. I was right. Okay, he destroyed it. Awesome. <clears throat> ha, go kill your fire dragon with that. Cause I do not feel so good. Did I mention that I was keeping all of these treasures for my ice dragon master? He's going to be really mad that you took it. Just great. How are we going to defeat Akrilov now? Wait, maybe Yuga can fix this. Yes, that's it. I'll take the broken ice side to him right away. Grunt. 19, haha, ha. uh, 20. Yes, use your anger, let revenge fuel you, ha ha ha. No, I can't go any further. What? Come on, I only put 100 pounds on there. Oh, wait a sec, I know what you need. I, ooh, wow, somebody's been doing some heavy lifting. I, I will avenge my family. How much is 100 pounds again? How much is pounds in kilograms? I'm not really sure. Uh, actually, let me pause the video and find out. I'm quite curious. Okay, 100 pounds is about 45 kilograms. Uh, let's see. How much can I bench? I think, yeah, that's pretty... I'm assuming it's 100 pounds on each side. Yeah, I would say that is about the same amount that I can bench. Also, yeah, approximately about this. Wait, no, 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 no. I, I can't bench. 40, uh, 45 kg on one side. That's a bit too much. I could do. Well, I haven't. I haven't bench pressed in a long time. I think. I think I could do like 30 on each side. Yeah, 30 kilos on each side. I'm not sure how much that is in pounds, but yeah, my my bench press is not that good because uh, it's not like I can practice every day or like I have a machine at home to practice every day. Like my my bicep curl is pretty good. Not not too show off, but. Yeah, I could curl 18 kg quite easily, but uh, my bench press is pretty weak. Much better. <laughs> oh, running god, I hate cardio. Freaking hate cardio. 
64, 65, 66. Wow, okay, so if you're doing 100 pounds of that, wow, that, that is impressive. Very, very impressive. I, I'm getting more powerful. I can feel the power flowing through me. Ah, that's it. So, bench pressing and freaking running up the stairs is supposed to help you gain fire abilities? Supposed to be able to help you fire back? That's it, tame the fire, the world will crumble before you. <laughs> this is a, quite a unique soundtrack, I don't think I've heard it before. This ancient key was part of Exhaust, a hoard of ill-gotten treasure. Blessing of the Northern Wind, so it's uh, DA only, so let's go ahead and sell that because there's no way you can use it. Not like we need to because we already got the best NDA kit in the game. Or at least the best kit for all resists, which is the wings, so yeah. Uh, next part, the weapon. You've returned. Yes, indeed I have. The mantle will return. What did you find in the Frozen North? Is there anything that can defeat Aquilov? We found the Ice Eye Yuga, but it's broken. Can you fix it? It's broken into too many shards for me to simply fix it. But magic still permeates the fragments. I can forge something new, something stronger, a frozen claymore. Really, you should be able to take down a kill off once and for all. Now my young apprentice, it is time for your final test. You are fully imbued with the power of fire, ha ha ha. Now it's time for you to use it. Take out anything incoming with a wave of flame, ha 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 ha. Oh, oh, a mini game. S A D W keys to move, click mouse to fire. Oh, oh nice, oh you can click hold, click and hold, wow, oh nice, ASDW keys to move, oh, wow, oh you can move out of the platform as well, time left, oh this, wow actually this is a pretty fun mini game I have to say, yeah I love it. Wow, body count 58. Ooh, wow, oh, I wish we get more this more often. This this is actually a pretty fun game. It's simple, but, but I like it. You are already Conan, go to exact your revenge. And become the tool of mine, the hero that chose to let your family die. The incompetent dragon slayer who let a quill of rampage, the ap apathetic mage who did nothing, they will burn. After you exact your revenge on the puny denizens of Falcon Reach, we will roll across this land. You will find an adventurer who foolishly gave the fire up to Akulov. You will burn purify and flame and this land and rule it all. Ha 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 ha. Rise my apprentice. Ooh. Rise to Conan. Ooh, I haven't heard of this soundtrack before either. There's a lot of old soundtracks in Dragon Fable that they used back in the day but they literally never use anymore nowadays. I wish they would, you know, reuse some of the old soundtracks so that like, you know, it doesn't go to waste. Some of the old soundtracks are actually decent. Like, I do prefer the newer soundtracks that we have nowadays but uh, some of the old soundtracks, I wish they could bring them back. I'm betting most of the Dragon Fa Fable players nowadays don't even recognize the, the older soundtracks. Like, for me, I, I definitely don't recognize them too, to be honest. I mean, back in the day, I Dragon Fable didn't even have music. So it was like just playing in silence. Or at least my my memory of Dragon Fable, because I used to play in school, so like the volume was never turned on. Uh, even if it was turned on, it was pretty soft. And like, you know, hiding in my parents' room to play it on the PC, I never turned on the sound so they wouldn't find out what the heck was doing in there so yeah never never had sound on before my childhood playing dragon fable was like in silence so yeah uh let's do one more you know what uh screw it the last episode was pretty lengthy so we'll cut it short for this episode you know what? i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video if you have be sure to give this video a thumbs up and of course subscribe to this channel if you guys would like to see more of such future content till the next time i'm your host carbine gaming peace out